Dunsborough is located west of Bustleton and is an alternative base to the larger town if you're visiting the wine growing areas to the southwest. Located at the northern end of WA's best known wine growing area, Dunsborough is close to some extraordinarily beautiful beaches and coastline. Bunker Bay, Eagle Bay, Milap, and Cape Naturalist are the closest attractions, but there's a great deal more to see within just a few minutes' drive. Land for a town site was set aside as early as 1830, and whaling operations by Messrs Vivish and Co were based in the area from about 1850. It wasn't until 1879 that the town site of Dunsborough was formally declared. The origins of the name are unclear, but old marine charts list a Dun Bay in the area. The bay was named by James Stirling after a fellow naval officer, Captain Richard Darling Dunn. The original spelling of Dunsborough ended with an O. Another suggestion for the origin of the name comes from a small town in Scotland, and yet another source claims that Dunn was an American whaler who used to anchor in the bay. The Aboriginal name for the area is Quedjinup. In 1907, the survivors of the Carnarvon Castle wreck came ashore in lifeboats. The ship had caught fire and was abandoned out to sea. A number of people lost their lives during this tragedy. Development in the area was fairly slow, with a general store opening in 1925, a bakery about five years later, then a hall in 1957, and a primary school in 1963. As surfing became popular in the 1960s, the area began to become more important as a tourist destination, and more major development took place from the 1970s. The destroyer, HMAS Swan, was scuttled off the coast in 1997. It provides an excellent site for diving enthusiasts. The Swan is one of the largest easily accessible dive wrecks in the Southern Hemisphere. 